Good day, good day, my friend. This is Charles with the Exodus Logistics Learning Center, uh, which features dispatching one-on-one -on -one training for beginners, as well as freight broker one-on-one -on -one training for beginners. Today is um, Wednesday, April 28th, 2021. Uh, we are having training tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, but I just wanted to do a, uh, a quick PSA, public service announcement, to explain a few things on the website. People are calling in and asking a few questions, and I figure if I put it in some general information uh, on the website, it can provide some clarity to those who are um, asking questions about that particular um, area. So on the website here at um, www.exodusdispatchingandtraining.com on our home page, this is our home page. Um, under our services, ELLC services, I may change the name to just services um, or just our services, but under services, we have partner affiliates, we have um, consultations. Here is where outside of the training and if someone is not a member and you need um, some consultations and ask questions that's going to that's going to exceed um, 30 to 60 minutes it's like 10 15 minutes you can call me 757-515-1684 uh, that's 757-515-1684 or you can email me at exodus logistics llc at yahoo.com that's Exodus, E-X-O-D-U-S, Logistics, L-O-G-I-S-T-I-C-S, L-L-C, at yahoo.com. So those are the two ways to reach me. If it's going to be beyond something that's going to take about at least 30 to 60 minutes, then I would recommend scheduling a consultation. So you'll come under E-L-L-C services to schedule a consultation. When you get to this page, you will see dispatcher or dispatch slash freight broker bookings or consultations. Whichever one is um, highlighted blue is the one that you want. So you can, if you wanted dispatching consultation, you would click on dispatch consultation. If you wanted freight broker consultation, you would click on that. And these are the different price points. The type of consultations we have, I'm going to click on dispatch consultation. The type of consultations we have are 30 and 60 minute phone consultations and their prices. And you can schedule now and then the 30 and 60 minute Zoom consultations where we come in and share our screen and on a Zoom call. So you have different price points for the 30 minute phone consultations, 30 bucks. So it's a dollar a minute, one dollar a minute for the 30 and 60 minute phone telephone consultations and then two dollars a minute for the 30 and 60 minute zoom consultation so 30 minutes at two dollars to sixty dollars on the zoom 30 minute um, zoom consultation and 120 for the 60 minute zoom consultation so those are the price points you would click schedule now to for the particular one you selected and you'll be able to continue from that process also under um, ELLC services, we do have our video testimonials area and different testimonials from different students who've um, taken the course recently and were satisfied with the, the outcome. And they're also doing video testimonials to speak about the offer that I had that's going to end from March to April, the end of April, where from your one month from your enrollment date or two months from your enrollment date, if you enrolled on a certain, um, like a month or so ago, and you found your carrier, booked that load, and moved that, that load, um, I would either give you a full refund or um, cancel your monthly subscription. So that's the video testimonials that's included with that special. Um, Dispatcher one on one people ask about the zoom training so everything if you enroll into the portal everything is under the 
dispatch a one-on-one -on -one header at the top. Okay, you got these headers, home, ELLC services, carrier services. This is specifically for truck drivers who want to fill out their online dispatch agreement and profile. Dispatcher 101 are for enrolled ongoing dispatcher 101 students. Freight broker 101 is for enrolled ongoing freight broker students. Okay, so we're speaking about dispatch training right now. So the very first sublink under dispatcher 101 is the Zoom live trainings. People ask, well, what days of the week are your training? So if you if you read it there, it says Zoom live Wednesdays, Saturdays, and Sundays. If you click on the link, it'll show you the actual information about that. Dispatch on 101, training for beginners, join our live online operational trainings, Wednesdays, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and that focus on beginner entry level dispatchers. Saturdays at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time, that also focuses on beginner entry level. And it, um, coincidentally, Saturday is also the days that we have our uh, Dispatch on one one seminar training. So we kind of include the seminar people who registered for the Saturday seminar trainings, along with beginner dispatching students as well, ongoing students. So we try to uh, kill two birds with one stone on that day there. And then Sundays, the, the third day, three, at, three days a week that we train, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And that's for intermediate kind of advanced people who are booking loads but want to strategize their next moves and things like that. So two days is for beginners, Wednesdays at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Everything, all my trainings are on um, in Eastern Standard Time, so you would have to compensate for whatever or adjust for whatever time zone you're in, okay? I'm on the East Coast in Virginia, so if you're on the West Coast, 6 p.m. will be 3 p.m. your time. If you're on the West Coast, 12 noon would be 9 a.m. your time, Pacific time. And if you're on the West Coast, um, Pacific time, 11 a.m. Eastern will be 8 a.m. Uh, Pacific time. That's a three hour time difference. So if you're, I'm on the East Coast, if you're Central time, that's an hour um, behind. So it just um, deduct one hour from the Eastern time. If you're um, Mountain time, deduct two hours. And if you're Pacific time, deduct three hours. That should, that should be um, an easy way for you to remember the time zone. So they go from East Coast over to West Coast, and you deduct an hour in each case. So the East, so your time zones are East Coast, Central, uh, uh, Eastern time zone, and then you go back an hour to Central time zone, and then you go back two hours from the um, Eastern time zone for Mountain time zone, and then you go back three hours from East Coast to Pacific time zone. So that's how that works. So you get to this page to get into the live Zoom trainings, and this page does not require a login. Even though this is an ongoing members portal, this page does not require a login. Anyone can log in. I still have to let you in, both as a member or a guest. So you get to this page, and it's recommended that you already have your own Zoom account set up with your specific personal email and password, and then you log into your Zoom account, and then you click to join a meeting. And when you click to join a meeting, it's going to ask you for a meeting ID, which is here for us, and a passcode, which is here for us to get into ours. You click this white box with the blue Zoom letters, it's going to take you to the Zoom page and to launch that meeting, okay? That's how that works typically. So people will ask questions, well, I can't get into the Zoom meeting, I'm having problems with the Zoom meeting. It is assumed that you um, first need to have your Zoom application or software installed on your computer. If you've been into a Zoom meeting before, you've already been into one successfully, then that's not an issue. But if it's your first time um, using Zoom, then it's, a Zoom, it's assumed that you set up your Zoom installation on your computer or whatever device that you're going to be using to log into the Zoom training. So you should do that ahead of time. Create your own personal email and password specific to your Zoom account, and then click, when you log into that Zoom account, click to join a particular Zoom room or a particular meeting, and you enter whatever meeting ID and passcode for that specific meeting that you will want to join. Our particular meeting ID and passcode is right here. And this is where you get it from. 
our Zoom page, sub page there, okay? Next is our, there's three different price um, items on our portal. The first one is our Dispatcher 101 seminar. That's a one day seminar. It is not ongoing. It's a one day seminar where we give you high level um, training on what a dispatcher is and what, what they do, what types of materials that they're, that's needed to start out as a beginner dispatcher, things like that, very high level. We don't go into great details, but the materials that we do include uh, in the training we go over. So you have at least an overview of what that is. Okay, we give away three free eBooks. We give away a glossary of basic terms. Uh, those are for you, for you to keep. And then we also um, give you a copy of our, or what a dispatcher agreement looks like. We go over that. We give you a copy of what a carrier profile looks like. We go over that because each dispatching company um, have or has a diff different philosophy of their specific company. So you would take that dispatcher agreement that we give you and that profile, carrier profile that we give you, use it as a template to structure your company under. We also give you copies of what um, a carrier's MC authority looks like, what a carrier's W-9 looks like, what a carrier's certificate of insurance looks like. And if a carrier has a factory and company, what a carrier's um, notice of assignment look like looks like okay so just so you would know as a dispatcher because the two main documents you're going to need as a dispatcher are the dispatcher agreement and the profile to send to the carrier when they return that in email format or however format they return it in then you want to get copies of the other four documents that i just mentioned w9 mc authority certificate of insurance and noa so we show you those and then next we show you the two broker um, pieces of paperwork that you're going to be dealing with uh, when you're booking loads for your carriers. And those are the broker carrier agreements and the rate confirmations. So we cover this in a two hour session, or at least we try to, along with questions and answers. If after the seminar training, you are interested in continuing and getting more training, ongoing training, and you wish to do that through our training um, program, Dispatcher 101 ongoing, what you paid for the seminar training, $99, will be deducted from the cost of the um, ongoing training. So $399 for the ongoing training minus the $99, and I will invoice you a specific invoice for the difference. That's how that works. And you let, I'll mention it toward the end of the seminar training. I will say something like, for those of you who are interested in continuing or wanting ongoing training who have registered for this training, just let me know either through text or email and I will put that in the chat. And you have an unlimited amount of time to decide um, when you want to, or even if you want to become an ongoing uh, member of our training, Dispatcher 101. Because you've registered and, you, and you've attended the seminar, then you automatically qualify for that special offer. There is an unlimited amount of time. There is no set time that is going to expire. You can take your time in deciding um, when you want that to happen, okay? The seminar trainings are Saturdays at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time, every Saturday. Unless we cancel a day for whatever reason, they, they're generally every Saturday, okay? So that's, that's the first price point, the $99. The second price point, which is not training, it is just people just want um, information, um, forms. So I've created a starter kit that includes um, uh, a lot of the forms that you're going to need. Uh, in addition to the, all the forms that I send you in the starter kit for the seminar, I also send you uh, carrier call scripts in this in this Dispatcher 101 starter kit. This is an extensive um, Dispatcher 101 starter kit. It contains the workflow of dispatching, the role of a dispatcher, low details cheat sheet, um, a map of the USA, in addition to what you receive in the Dispatcher 101 seminar starter kit, the Dispatcher 101 starter kit that's outside of the seminar training includes that plus more. Okay, so, uh, and that's 199 that this is not include training, but 
it's just materials. Um, but I do offer, um, if you decide that you want to um, participate in ongoing training, that I can take the 99, the 199, I'm sorry, that you paid for the Dispatcher 101 Starter Kit 199 and deduct that even so from the 399 cost of the ongoing training. So you, if you take the seminar, you can deduct $99 from the ongoing cost if you decide to roll over into ongoing training, or if you just purchase a Dispatcher Starter Kit at 199 and then later on decide to um, roll over into ongoing training, you can deduct the 199 from the 399. So there's no 199 for the starter kit and then 399 for the um, ongoing training. I trying to save you um, some money because I understand um, our money's tight. We're in a pandemic, we're in a recession, so I'll try to help. Okay, so that's the second price point. The third one is the ongoing training. So what this is, this is our comprehensive, extensive ongoing training, and there's either a single member ongoing training at $399, or there is a two for one. Two people can join for $599. In both cases, you get the same thing. Um, you get back office access with your own email and password set up. So say you enroll, I send you a welcome email with instructions on how to set up the back office password and email. Once you do that, you go to orientation. We have materials about business setup, information, EIN, LLC, things like that. We have four ex uh, exclusive modules that cover the basics of freight dispatching, um, carrier acquisition, load boards, booking the loads, and invoicing the carriers. We do live trainings three times a week. Three times, three times a week. I said twice a week, but I'll change that to three times a week. Um, Wednesdays at six. Saturdays at noon and Sundays at 11. We offer back office recorded training videos. So what that means is all our videos are recorded. All of our trainings, our live trainings are recorded three times a week and they are stored in our back office portal under training videos library, okay? And only enrolled members who have access, who have approved access to the back office portal can access those training videos. No longer do we put extensive trainings on YouTube, we may put small snippets, but our extensive trainings are only stored in our back office portal for, for enrolled subscription-based members. Speaking of subscription-based, um, so you initially enroll at either a single member price point or a two-for-one price point. One month after the enrollment, there is a $19.99 monthly subscription one month after the initial enrollment for up to a year if you decide to stay in it that long. The purpose of that is to give you access to everything in our back office, forms, documents, tools, resources, and uh, particularly low boards. We have uh, several low boards, I would say five or six at minimum right now that we offer and we share logins with you for that you can, these are live load boards, you can book loads um, for your carriers. But back office forms, back office documents, back office tools and resources, everything is extensively in one centralized location. Uh, you initially enroll at whatever price point, single member or two for one. And then one month after that date, we start the um, monthly subscription for you if you want to maintain access to those back office tools and resources. And, and that lap can last up to a year if you decide to do that. You may not need a year to learn how to dispatch, but as long as you are maintaining your 1999 monthly subscription, then you will have access to those um, tools and resources. Now, when you initially enroll, because here's a question as well, when you initially enroll, you will get access from day one. Once you get, once you enroll, I get an email saying that you enrolled. I send a reply welcome email for you to set up your email and password. Once you do that process and I approve you for back office access, then you have immediate access from that point on. You, don't, you do not have to wait one month after you initially enroll and pay the enrollment to get access. No, that's not the case. You get access the moment you get approved for back office um, uh, support. So, okay. So just giving you guys some basic information because people ask questions about um, pricing and different um, what's this for, what's that for, and things like that. So I wanted to, to create a video to answer that question. I'm going to change the website a little bit 
three times a week and up to up to one year membership. So I'll do that in a second, but just wanted to give you a PSA about that and uh, go from there. Okay, so hopefully that answered some questions. I will have links in the description to how to, to enroll and things like that, my contact information. But um, for those of you who are um, enrolled members, I will see you guys tonight at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time for our Wednesday night basics, Dispatcher 101 training for beginners. All right, talk to you soon. Thank you.